Hello everyone, and welcome back to Flying Princess Plays Final Fantasy VIII. Okay, so last uh, episode was crazy. I finished disc one, even though this is like a PS4 game, it's like a PS, you know, for uh, insert remaster, but you know, technically if it was the PlayStation, it'd be, play it'd be disc two. Last episode, Squall got stabbed with like ice things that Edia threw at him, and he's not, you know, dead at all. Spoiler! I feel like you're super duper young. Aka Laguna, there's someone here to see you! Huh? Me? What's this person look like? He's wearing funny clothes! He's talking to Rain right now! Hmm, is he at the pub? Yep, that's why I came over to get you too, Aka Laguna! Am I a good girl? No, you're not. It's dangerous to be out there by yourself. What if a monster comes and attacks you? It's only next door. It's okay. It's still dangerous. And since you're such a cute little girl, the monsters will especially be after you. They'll catch you, and then they'll suck all your blood out. If anything like that should happen, Uncle Laguna's gonna cry. I'll be okay. I'll just call you Uncle Laguna. You'll come rescue me, right? Hey, hey, oh, whoa, wait. Okay. God, that's a draw point that's invisible. Amazing. I win. Am I a good girl? Yes, a good girl. Dear Lone's father and mother, Lone's been a good girl today. Right? Yep. God, look at that thing. It's so ugly. It's like... <laughs> it's so gross. <laughs> Alone. Now's your chance. Chance. <laughs> so cute. You understand alone. Now go in your room and play. I got into trouble. That's because you broke your promise. Too bad. But good night. Use proper English when speaking to alone. I got in trouble. Too bad. God, they're adorable. It's been a while, Laguna. Kuros! It's Uncle Laguna's friend. He just is funny, but he's not a bad guy. You seem well. Yeah, you too. Hey, how long has it been? You know our grand escape from Sentra? That was one would usually call that being chased out. I thought so. Well, I would say about a year or so. I was bedridden for over six months. It seemed like every bone in my body was in pieces. I nursed him back to health. Thank you for taking good care of Maguna. I was able to recover in about a month or so. Ever since then, I've been searching for you. Why? After leaving the army, well, just killing time, I guess. Life's pretty boring without you as entertainment, my man. That's a harsh thing to say. I've been living in a productive life here. I think I understand what you mean, though. So, what do you want to know? Let's see. What's Ward up to? War quit the army, too. Luckily, he found a job, and he's working pretty hard. What's he doing? He's a janitor down at the district prison. Wow. Can't picture him mopping floors, but I'm glad he's doing well. Oh, and he never got his voice back. You could basically tell what he wants from his facial expressions. So, what do you want to know? Let's see. How's Julia doing? I don't know. You mean Julia the singer? That's right. Laguna really admired her and always frequented the nightclub. 
Shut up! So what if I did? Julia is a saint in the nightclub? No, she didn't sing. She just played the piano. Then the first song she released was Eyes on Me? How's that song go? You don't know? Well, you never let me hear it. I didn't think you listened to music. The song's about being in love. I really like it. Heard she recently got married. Oh yeah! To some army general, right? General Carraway or something? I'm not too sure. I read in a magazine that her true love went off to war and never came back. General Carraway confronted her while she was feeling down. That's how they got to know each other. So she didn't wait for the soldier to come back? So what? Who cares? As long as she's happy, right? That's all that matters. Ain't that right, Al? I'm right! We're gonna- ah. <laughs> you two are- yeah, yeah, she said something about rain. Oh my goodness, yeah, I ship this. I ship it, it's cute. So, what do you want to know? I think the fairies are here. Fairies? Yeah, I guess so. Then our work today should be a cinch. Looking forward to the battles. So, what do you want to know? Let's talk later. Time to do some work. Okay. So, what's your plan? You're gonna stick around here for a bit, right? Would that be okay? Work for what you eat! If it's fine with you, you're more than welcome. Luguna, I have some question. What exactly do you do here? It's like this. All the working men in this town are sent off to war. The only ones still left in town are old people, children, truckloads, dogs, and cats. And I'm sure you've noticed, but the monsters have made their way into town. This here town took real good care of me, so basically I want to return the kindness. You're looking at the Monster Hunter of Windhill. So as of today, you'll be my assistant. We are to patrol the town up to the town entrance. If we see anyone in need along the way, we'll help them. That's our basic duty. Alright, our first patrol complete! A report to the commander and assist commander. Commander? You mean that woman at the pub? Her name's Rain. Rain, okay? She saved my life. And the assistant commander is alone. She seems like a really nice person, but easily taken in by a hot shot. A hot shot? Okay, let's step up the patrol a notch. This is Kuros. Let's come up with a plan after we get back to the base. Hey, Laguna. Are you doing this patrol thing every day? Thing? What are you calling thing? Were you aiming to become a world traveling journalist? You've heard of the Timber Maniacs, right? I had a talk to the chief editor. He said he's interested in any article related to world travel. That's great! We should go talk to him sometime. Y yeah. Hmm. Um, it'd be okay if we stayed here a bit longer, right? You need time to gather more material? This seems like a really nice town. You're going to write about this place first, aren't you? No way! Can't make this place famous. Too much publicity and get all those tourists and stuff. You're afraid someone might come and take Rain away? Luguna, you changed, man. Hey, I see a monster! What? Girl talk. Let's come back later. Come on. Something inside me tells me to listen. Rain, aren't you gonna marry Uncle Laguna? A guy like that? He was carried in here crying like a baby and I was the one who had to take care of him. This crew way of speaking. I don't know if his aspirations as a journalist are true. Every time I try to have a serious conversation, he avoids it. I can't stand his snoring. He talks in his sleep. But he's really nice. I really, really like him. Rain, Uncle Laguna, and Al should be together. But you know... I think what he really wants to do is travel all over the world. I don't think he has it in him to live in a quiet country town like this one. 
Some people are like that. Oh, that makes me so mad. You don't like him? I feel the same as you alone. Oh? I came back in a hurry. Here's my report on today's patrol and monster extermination. Including... Uh, including Bublicious... Oh, what the fuck is that word? Okay. Including Bakchubuchuas and Bun Buns. That assistant commander alone oh so hates. I've exterminated 20 monsters. Alright, thank you. Shall we eat before we get started on next patrol? I'll call you when it's ready, so just wait in your room. You seem pretty tired. You should take a quick nap. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat all together. You're joining us too, right, Mr. Kiros? We have me and Rain and Uncle Luguna and Kiros! <laughs> She's so adorable! She kills me! I get scared sometimes. Scared of waking up somewhere else. Scared of not seeing alone. Scared of not seeing Rain. What happened to me? I, I feel... What is this I'm feeling? Oh, please let it be this room when I wake up. Please let me be in this puny bed when I wake up. Luguna, you've changed. Mm-hmm. Where am I? Ah, oh, welcome back, Zell. The dream world again? Uh-huh. How's the guy doing? Don't know. I didn't see him. It's not like I know everything about Ward, but... Well, you know Lacuna and company went to that central place and got into a real fix, right? After that, Ward's been all alone. He's working in some sort of prison-like place. And he's bored out of his mind. All he wants to do is be fighting alongside Laguna. So, what's this we're all experiencing? How the hell should I know? Well, since we're prisoners, shouldn't we be trying to break out of here? Huh, <laughs> yeah, good point. Um, didn't you say that War was working in some sort of prison? Yeah, so? And wasn't he from Galbadia? Sure, he's a soldier there. I wonder what happened to Squall. Did they bring him here too? if I'm wrong, but aren't you supposed to be roared in that dream world? Just now I was. Does this room look familiar? Wow, the stupid question. Hey, whoa, wait a sec. I know this place. Everyone, listen up. This is the prison that War works at. He's a janitor here. There's so many rooms just like this. It's gotta be here. There's a prison for political activists in Galbadia. This must be the place where War works. Right here, where we are. I'm sure of it. It's no surprise we're in jail. We did attack the sorceress. He went up against the president. We're all supposed to be sentenced to death. That president is no longer in charge. Now that the is in the hands of the sorceress, what's going to happen to us? Things don't look so good. What's going to happen to us? Where the hell is that guy, Irvine? Where's Squall? Did the sorceress... Ooh. Oh, my beautiful man. Where am I? I challenged Idia, my wound. No wound? How? The Gabini soldiers. You were surrounded. 
was there. Cypher leering down at me. Damn you, Cypher! That's some high-tech prison you got there. What? What? What was that loud noise? I don't like him at all. It's the sound of your friend being tortured. What? What do you mean? Shut up! Don't screw around with me! I don't like kids that screw around! You understand who's in charge here? I'm asking you a question. Oh! Oh! <sighs> Stop! Oh, I almost forgot. Hey man, is there a Renoa with you? I'm Renoa. Oh, alright, then come over here. What are you doing to Renoa, you bastard? Oh, stop it! Stop it already! Stop! I'll go! Mm. Renoa! I'll be fine. Let's go. Squall, you're pitiful. Okay, how can he possibly be that strong to throw him against the wall by his hair? Jeez. He's an asshole. Take him away. I'm sure you can imagine what happens now. Mm. What do you want? Tell me what seed is. Idia demands to know. Seed. A codename for Bangarn's elite mercenary force. Seed compact specialists. Don't you already know? I'm not a seed. There must be some kind of secret you're given when you have your seed. There's nothing. Even if there were, you think I'd tell you. You're on my tough nut to crack list. Didn't think you talked that easily. Jeez, I'm honored. So here's a little something for you. Oh, ha, ha. Oh. Even if you don't talk, others will. The instructor, the little messenger girl, or that chicken wuss. He won't last three seconds. But they're... They're all here? Oh, you bet. But since I like you so much, I thought you should go first. I was hoping you'd be there, Squall. So, how to look at my moment of triumph. My childhood dream fulfilled. I've become the Sorceress's Knight. Okay, you know, dude, 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 dude. You didn't do anything. I kicked your ass, okay? There's no triumph for you. It was for Edia. She beat her asses, not you. You suck. Sorceress Knight. This romantic dream? But Cypher, now you're just... a torturer. What did you say? Passed out cold, eh? This is the scene where you swear your undying hatred for me. The tale of the evil mercenary versus the sorceress's knight. The fun's just started, Squall. Don't disappoint me now! Oh, stop! Oh. My man. Draw! Cure! Oh, 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 oh. It's no use. There seems to be an anti-magic field here. <laughs> Those things are cute. Oh. What was that noise? You again. Ah. Damn him, that numbskull. I'll stop him. 
Yo, who do you think you are? Yeah, you big meanie, stop that! <laughs> You'll regret those words! He's so mean! You okay? Doesn't work so well, but... Cure! Well now, Squall, I'll ask again. What is Seed, and why do they oppose the Sorceress? Seed... Oppose the Sorceress? Cypher, the missiles targeted to the garden are ready to launch. Excellent. Baum Garden is to be destroyed on charge as the train seeds to oppose the sorceress. What? It's a pity, really. I grew up there, too. But orders are orders, and Edia wants it destroyed. No. After the garden's gone, the seed hunt will begin. I'll be Edia's bloodhound and hunt everyone down of your kind. It'll be fun, Squall. Don't die on me yet. Continue with the interrogation. Ready to talk? I don't understand the question. Don't mess with me. EDS says you know something. Now spit it out. Talk! What is Seed all about? Seed, aren't we mercenaries from Baum Gardens with special forces? Mm, yeah, so? I don't know anything. Why do you keep asking me? Just let me die. Eh, I'll lie. Just live. What is that? Flower. What did you say? The true gold of seed to spread seeds all over the world. <laughs> that sounds so stupid. You, um, uh, make flowers? I control all plants. Fill the world with, with flowers. Yeah, right. It's, it's the truth. See, seeing flowers takes away people's will to fight. What then? Steve wants to bring love and peace to the world? Haha! <laughs> Don't make me laugh, you can't fool me. We steal the world to fight. Then we invade. What? Hey! Watch him. What now? What do we do? Just stay here? We'll get tortured for sure. We can't just sit here. We have to think of a way to escape. Anyone got a plan? Well, we could skin this little guy and wear him as a disguise. Oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Doesn't sound like you are. Well, we can't rely on magic here, so we have to go with weapons. We have to somehow get them back. Weapons. My weapons are these fists of mine. I could do serious damage without weapons. It's up to me, baby. Let me go. I'll go get the weapons back. Oh, yeah! You worked here as Ward, so you know the place. Not really. A Ward did was not the force. Just leave it to me. You two lie down here. So... I hope this works. Guard, guard, we need some help. Open the door. What's the problem? The women are unconscious. 
I think a snake bit him. What? <laughs> well, I'm off. Huh? You wanna go too? Uh, I guess just don't get in the way. You escapee? Yo, I'm here to reclaim these. Yeah, they're mine. Thank you. And... Come on. Put down. Yeah! Piece of cake, baby! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Yo, sorry to keep you waiting. Is that the weapons? Voila! Waha! Alright! Time to go kick some ass! <laughs> yes! Alright on! <laughs> Alright! <laughs> is this the cell with the uncorrupted prisoners? Yes, this is it. Please give them something to really complain about. Should we be picking on the prisoners so soon after getting transferred here? Just be quiet and let me handle this. Gotta kick your ass. We're prepared. These are the prisoners, Lieutenant Biggs and Private Witch. Hey, Biggs and Witch. Ah! So we meet again. Now we'll teach you the lesson we should have taught you earlier. I know it might seem cowardly to fight unarmed prisoners. But I hope you appreciate your position. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> uh, they're fully armed, sir. What? Ha ha! Ah, hell with it. Let's go, Wedge. <laughs> this will be easy peas. I was demoted because of you. I'm the lieutenant now. I'll get my revenge. There we go. Ooh, we're flat. That's a nice one. Alright, slow. Ooh, oh, this guy's got regen. Oh, I'm gonna take it for everything it's worth. Sweet. Your regen is mine. Give it to me. Give me more. Give me more. I want to be satisfied with that. Oh, come on. No, I need regen. No, give me regen. Oh, give me a fuck. Oh, come on. All right, go Shiva! Don't think you could just walk out. Ugh. Squall should be around here somewhere. Do you have any idea? I guess not. We find Squall, and then we're out of here. Got it. What the? Morning. Escapee alert. Monsters will be set loose on each floor. Oh, great. If the escapee refuses to surrender, you have permission to kill. The anti-magic field will be lifted. <sighs> Security alarm! Hey! Squall! Wake up! Come on, Squall. I'm fine. You okay? It was hell.
hell. Let's just get the hell out of here. Catch! Laguna! Laguna! Laguna? Thank goodness you're alright. Let's go. Didn't you come here as Laguna in the dream world? No. So Squats didn't know how to get out either. Well, either way, we kept going up and up. I think we better head back down. Be a pain to go down every floor. They alarm a lot of monsters and security guards everywhere. By the way, how the hell did they carry you up here, Squall? Whoa, what's this? It's like a crane that can carry a detachable cell from downstairs. Oh, so big hole goes all the way to the bottom. So if we jump all the way down, we're out of here. Go ahead if you want to be squashed like a pancake. Oh yeah, I remember now. We can move this arm by using the panel above to the control room. I remember Ward doing this. But we need to operate them both at the same time. Someone needs to stay upstairs to control the panel. <laughs> Me? <laughs> Fine. I'll give you instructions from upstairs. Everyone get inside. So, this is the arm control room. Yo, can you guys hear me? Hi, it's out loud and clear! So, what do we do now? Press the red button on the main panel. I'll take care of the rest. There! So, what are we going to do now? Well, there's a floor over there. And? Let's check it out. Can we get out? If only we could get out of here. Sand? Buried? You mean, we're underground? In any case, we can't get out from here. What was that? Gunfire? Sounds pretty bad. So! Let's get back quick! There he is over there! Seize the escapee, dead or alive! T too many, I'm out of here. Ah! You bastard! Die! Ah! I don't think it would die that easy. Squall! Thanks, man! What? Let go! I said let go! <laughs> Squall, Zell! I'm glad you're alright. Squall, why did you go down on your own? Is Zell that important to you? Oh, <laughs> romance. Yeah, ah! Romance. There's no way we can get out of here. Uh -oh. All right, Irvine. Come on. Stop trying to act so cool! Gee, if only you had agreed with me earlier, we wouldn't be in this mess. Squall! Squall's alive. I knew he would be. Squall's okay. Yeah! Ronoa, you alright? Uh-huh. Of course. Courtesy of my escort. What's that supposed to mean? Uh... My father pulled some strings with the military. He told them to get to me and only me out. Then... So this guy here... He came and got me. Just me. Knowing you were all captured! 
Uh, that's isn't that horrible? All right, all right. I said I was sorry. That's why I'm here to help. After I scratched to death. Uh. Anyhow, now's our chance. The basement door is buried in the sand. Of course it is. This place is buried underground. Buried? That's right. This prison is. There they are. The escapees. Squall. You choose two more parry members to head on up. I'll hold them here. Up? Don't have time to explain now. The exit's up there. Trust me. Okay. I think I know the way. Oh man, this is endless. Yo, what's the next move? Hmm. Hi! Can we just go up again using the arm? I think Squally is already up there. Hey, good idea. But they gotta operate it from the room upstairs. Leave that to me. Alright, let's head to the floor where the arm stopped. Okay, everyone, I think I'm gonna stop there. I know it's like in the middle of a whole huge heist, but I've been playing for like a really long time. So I'm gonna go take a break, and I will see you next time. Bye!